Yo, every time I sit there and I say to myself, I think I'm kind of, kind of wearing kind of thin on, on McFarlane. Yo, these fools, come, these fools come out swinging, yo. Oh my God. Oh my God. It's like, yo, Todd Father don't play, man. Todd Father's like, yo, I got something. He's like, come here, come here. Let me show you something real quick. Let me show, let me, let me show you what's really good in, in this vehicle game. Because let me tell you something. A lot of people feel a lot of ways about McFarlane, and some of it's justified, some of it's not. But McFarlane makes the best freaking vehicles on the market, in my opinion, my humble opinion. On the, you know, I I uh, every vehicle I've purchased from McFarlane has been one reasonably priced and two great quality. Now. Full disclosure, I do not own the motorcycle from the previous Batman movie. I don't own that one. So, full disclosure, that one's a piece of crap. I don't know. Um, but as far as the ones I do own, uh, the Dark Knight's Metal Bat Cycle, the uh, skeleton with the Bat Skeleton, dope as shit. Dope. 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 The, uh, the curse of the white knight bat cycle it's cool i like it i like it a lot the bat raptor now the thing about that bad boy is like it just the figure sits weird bat every batman i've tried in there sits pretty weird so i mean and grain of salt looks good but grain of salt with that one the uh batmo beast that monster truck <laughs> that's all i gotta say to that but yeah and i i been i you know i was pleasantly surprised to be wrong about this one i i said i don't think they'll ever ever make the uh 89 movie batmobile i i never in a million years thought they were gonna make that one um and yeah i was wrong dead wrong i was dead wrong and People started posting on our IG, sending it to me, and they were like, "Hey, you said you said they would never do it. Here it is. Here it is." And yo, yeah, Todd, man, Todd, Todd, father, my man's like turning into like that movie Goodfellas, where it's just like, "Fuck you, pay me." Oh, you 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 paid all that money for a Haslab, man. Fuck you, pay me. That uh, Eternia playset holding you down a little bit. Man, fuck you, pay me. <laughs> oh, 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 you were looking at that thunder tank, ain't you? You were looking at that thunder tank. Man, fuck you, pay me. <laughs> that's that's all Todd sounds right now. Because, like, yo, he, he about to get all this money. All right, once again, he about to get all this money. He know, you know, every time I think he's just kind of out of touch with the audience and just isn't giving us what we want, stuff like this occurs. He still isn't giving us classic Wonder Woman because there's like I, somebody did a count. It is like 20 different versions of classic Wonder Woman you can do because of all the different artists and everything who depicted Wonder Woman the same, who basically depicted Wonder Woman with just small changes. He still hasn't given us that classic look on Wonder Woman. We have Wonder Woman with like buzz cuts and mohawks and shit. We ain't got fucking <laughs> classic Wonder Woman. But yeah, he's given us a classic Batmobile. Like he's already given us the 60s, the 1960s uh, Batmobile. Now we're going to have the 89 Batmobile. The only Batmobiles that are now going to be missing for my collection in a larger scale, like 110th, 110th, 112th scale uh would be let me see that would be the animated series batmobile another one i freaking love um and the uh the christian bale batmobile which i think is just once again another beast beast of oh my god i would love that thing love it in my collection but he's he's not playing he's coming for your money and then rumor has it they're gonna do like the 89 Batwing. Oh man. Like, what? Where am I gonna. I'll have space for all this shit. <laughs> I 
oh, space for all this stuff, man. I'm like, yo, I bear, like, I just made space for some stuff, and now this fool gonna come out with a bat wing too. Oh my god, man. It's not even about the price. It's about the space. You know how much shit I'm going to have to clear out to make room for this stuff? Oh, my God. And I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it because I want these things. These things must be purchased. But, yeah, man. Another thing real quick was this uh, steel figure. I, um, I, yeah, this thing looks so good. It looks so good. I was just like, yo. Todd coming out swinging, man. Oh my god! Like, I, yeah. Oh my god! Like, I'm, I'm really excited. Like, the vehicles have pretty much been a no-brainer for me. So this, these will be no-brainers for me. These vehicles, this steel figure, I really like the look. I like the look. I want to see what it looks like in person. I kind of like, I, 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 I kind of take McFarlane figures with a grain of salt sometimes because some of them be like, oh uh, no, other ones be like, ah oh, man, I gotta get this. <laughs> like, you know, like pu push, push an old lady out the way. I gotta get to the aisle, man. <laughs> but yeah, let me know what you think in the uh, comments. Are, are you interested? in this Batmobile or is this a pass for you? Do you think $90 is still too expensive for this? Do you think it could be possibly $80? Do you think that for, you know, you'd have to wait and see what the rest of the offering of that is? Are you interested in that steel figure? Like, do you even care about that steel figure? I don't know. Let me know in the comments. Let me know what you think. And uh, also make sure you like, share, comment, and subscribe. Make sure you check out the uh, community tab. That's where I post all the fig deals I find. Any pre-orders that come up, including this one eventually when it does pop up. And um, any restocks that I come across, I post them on the uh, community tab on the page. Also check out the Amazon affiliate link in the description. It's pretty easy. All you have to do is click on the link and buy away. And Amazon will pay me a commission and it doesn't cost you anything extra. And it's a great way to support the channel. Now, with that said, with that said, be safe, be good. And this is a Drunken Prime cracking open another beer and signing off.